point of writing is not to escape. It's more like just reconnecting with myself in a very real way. That quiet time to just feel like I'm truly in this world. When I'm on the bike, I can collect my own thoughts and feel like, yeah, I'm really here. I'm smelling the environment around me. I'm feeling the temperature. I'm sensing the speed. There's just so much more dimensionality to a bike like the Panamerica. You're not confined to even pavement. You can pretty much go anywhere you want and get out to these places where you're not going to have reception and you're just going to be there providing for yourself, cooking something simple and sleeping on the ground. It speaks to this whole American kind of like John Wayne aesthetic that I really am drawn to. The only way to get that authenticity is to actually go out and subject yourself to some of these things. Inevitably, you're faced with something that you didn't anticipate at all. You have to get out of your own head a little bit, work it out, improvise, or tough it out. If you're on the dirt, you're standing. And when I'm standing like that, I feel so like weightless and comfortable. I'm so relaxed. I'm just like floating. The individual components of the bike have a lot of Harley-Davidson DNA, but they still have this very honest design language. And that's what really appeals to me. This country, it's super accessible for a machine like that. I still want to be able to challenge myself and go out there and do stuff that makes me grow as a person, builds character, and not just live your life in a manner that you look back on in 20 years and you just feel like, whatever, I got a good job, I took care of my family, but I didn't, don't really have any stories to tell. Looking back, I feel like I accomplished something, I did something, I had to kind of overcome this or that challenge. I want that, I seek that. That's part, for me, of being alive and like being a part of the world. <laughs>